Yo, what's up everybody? Time to do 2017 Panini Prism Football. It's a 12 box full case break. Number one eBay style. Let's get to it. Uncut game. Patience, my man. Patience. Good luck, everybody. Yeah, this is eBay. This is eBay. A full case of this. I gotta do two cases of this tonight. Let's see what's in here. Oh boy. That's a lot of stuff. Prism came out today, Lucas. Where you been, bro? Uh, if I can get it full unk got game, then I will. That's the only way we do store breaks is once all teams are gone, then I will break it. So tell your friends. Tell your friends to tell their friends. Get them up in here. The more the merrier so we can get this stuff filled up. Okay, that's different. Haven't seen that before. The, the way they put them together there. Okay. Alright, let's open this up. First pack mojo, of course, always to see what it looks like. Okay, the good old, good old prism. Got some purple cracked ice here for Noah Brown and the Cowboys. That's a cool looking card. Number to 75. Refractors. Okay, okay. So first pack, just to uh, show you what it looks like. I'm going to open the rest of these packs here. And go through the box. Uh, Lucas G. Honest answer. Because we got to like that. Don't worry your pretty little head about how we get product the day of release day. Just know that uh, money makes everything possible in this world. That pack fell a little extra thick. Alright, let's see what's in the rest of this box. I did open up one pack. It was the first pack. I haven't seen this stuff yet. What? To 75 already. We begin with a Deshaun Watson. That is a big time card. There you go. Very nice. That's how you start a break off. First auto. One of the big names. Deshaun Watson. Very nice. Very nice. What else we got? Wait. 
What is this? Is this numbered? It is to 149. Don't know what that parallel is uh, called. Lucas, I've been sent you a code, my man. I've been sent you a code. You just never used it, man. Check your email. I emailed you a long time ago, bro. Odori well, Jackson of the Titans with the autograph. Or I could be mistaken, Lucas G. Send me an email, ripcitycards at gmail.com. And uh, if I haven't already given you that code, I'll type up another one and get it out to you. When I do have time to do it. Isaiah Ford of the Dolphins with the autograph. Sports Cards Freak, stop spoiling stuff for me, like for real. Like, I'm about to ban you. Final warning. Well, that's kind of cool, though. The instant impact uh, insert for Fournette. That's a cool looking card. Nice. Got some color there on the back. That's a cool card. For the Buccaneers, Chris Godwin. I always check numbers on the card, Katie. Come on now. It's a 199 Chris Godwin right there. I always check the numbers. Well, who knows, uh, H-Town? Maybe I just got, you know, hot cases. Maybe I got a Watson in every case. Who knows? Maybe I got a 101 Watson in another case. Lots of things can happen. The Matt Forte of the Jets to 149, I believe. Yep, look at that. Your boy knows. Your boy knows. Aaron Donald of the Rams. Number to 199. The Jackson. You got me going back in time, Katie. Come on, Katie. It's the 149, though, for the Titans. Everybody gets one. Everybody gets one. James White of the Patriots. A little color on there. But that is number two, 199. I hope this break doesn't take me, you know, two and a half hours like that NBA Hoops did. That was just painful. Jason Witten of the Cowboys with that green stuff. That is a cool looking card. Numbered to 99. A cracked ice, a purple cracked ice. For Travis Benjamin of the Chargers. Cool looking card. That is numbered to 75. Well, there's also the Supers, H-Town. There's also the Supers. Mike Wallace of the Ravens, orange. That is nice. Numbered to 275. Nothing there. So that was the first box. Whole bunch of base cards. And just one box. All those base in one box? Oh, man. All right, let me put this stuff away. RPA in the case? Damn. 
Three autos, nine numbered parallels per box on average. Sixers lost at the buzzer? Who'd they play? I think Lonzo's playing right now against the Wizards, too. Honestly, all the packs feel a little thick. Like, this one feels a little thick. They all feel thick, honestly. Against the Rockets. Who hit it? James Harden? I wonder if the Heat won. Heat played the Spurs tonight. Alright, what do we have in this box here? Got a David Moore. For the Seahawks, got that camouflage on there. David Moore is to 25. Robert Woods of the Rams, orange. That is to 275. The Heat lost, well, damn. Well, there goes my mood. What do we have here? For the Niner, Solomon Thomas with the auto. What else we got here? 13 Thomas refractor there for the Jets, Elijah McGuire, orange. That's number two seventy five. The, uh, we play the Ravens tomorrow. We play the Ravens tomorrow. Going to be a tough game. So I see the redemption up there. Another Elijah McGuire for the Jets. You know, nothing's ever promised in baseball. The Elijah McGuire, the Jets, number to 199. For the Rams, Sammy Watkins. You know, they throw me off whenever, whenever they put those cards like upside down or backwards or whatever. I kind of just assume they're auto. See, like that one. Marlon Humphrey of the Ravens to 99 autograph. He has his tickets to the gun show. Do you? That's nice. Nice looking card. Did the Dodgers win? I mean, I'm watching the game right now, but I'm on a pretty big delay. It's at the uh, bottom of the eighth, two outs. With the top of the order uh, batting, I think. Corey Davis, Blue Wave Prism Redemption. That'll go out to the Titans. Need to open up another pack of top loaders here. Uh, John, I believe, well, actually, I have a link for you. 
I think it'll work for you. Let me uh, just copy and paste the link. It shows the uh, items we have for sale. So that's, you know, more or less the, uh, the schedule. Break times are in the description of each listing. Uh, for those of you wondering. All right, let's continue with this box. James White of the Patriots to 149. Yep, 149. Got some color here for Gerald McCoy of the Bucks. Number to 199. Uh, well, Trevor, if it's on the eBay schedule, then yes. The answer is yes. Delaney Walker of the Titans, orange. That is number to 275. I am doing an NBA hoops at midnight. Oh, I'm super happy about that, Katie. You know, Matt Moore came in, and he was playing like a man possessed. Tom Brady, that's kind of funny how they put the uh, the mosaic in the background there. You know, because he is kind of like a god. Gerald McCoy, purple, cracked ice for the Bucks. Love Matt Moore. I love Matt Moore. Uh, that McCoy to 75. Way, way more than I like Cutler. Dude, Cutler sucks, man. We should have just let Matt Moore handle things. But no, we, we had to try to upgrade the position and go uh, with somebody who did not want to play anymore. Josh Malone of the Bengals. That's to 99. A lot of color in this product. Nice. I do like Matt Moore. Uh, he's going to be our starter for you know the next couple. I know he's starting tomorrow. Because uh, uh, Cuddy got some, uh, some ribs messed up there. So hopefully Matt Moore can uh, keep playing at a high level so he can maintain the starting job. Geno Atkins of the Bengals to 199. Uh, do I have anything good? You know, as far as this, have I pulled anything good? Uh, I don't know, man. You tell me. You tell me. That's one box down. And way more to go. Putting this stuff away. I'm, I'm, dude, I'm hoping that, you know, that Coach Gase is just over the infatuation with, uh, with Cutler and is like, alright, you know what, yeah, this is not gonna work. Deuces. Speaking of, this is not gonna work. I'm going to have to put this in a whole bunch of 400 count boxes. Yo! The Astros really just did that? Oh my god, we got a game. The Astros just tied it at the top of the ninth. It's now three up. Oh shit. Dodger fans looking like what just happened. Three outs away from going up 2-0 in the series. And Gonzalez smashes it. Solo home run in the top of the ninth. Dude, what a game.
Anybody watching the baseball game right now? Dodgers Astros? <coughs> Thank you. Don't ruin it for me, Sports Cards Freak. Don't ruin it for me. I just want to know if you're watching the game. Because I'm on a major delay. I'm on a huge delay. Is Carlos Beltran going to hit another homer here? Uh, I We do not sell... Uh, well, actually, we do on, like, uh, on eBay every now and then. We'll put cards up. Um, but I don't... I don't think we have any Damian Lillard autographs on us. If I'm being honest, Let's see what we have here. For the Texans to 149, Zach Cunningham. I already pulled the Watson, so anything else for the Texans is a is you know a little extra snack for them. How's Lonzo doing out there for the Lakers? Is John Wall giving him fits? Trent Taylor of the Niners orange. That means his number to what? Two something? Yep, two seven five. For the one four nine Mike Williams Chargers. Uh, Lucas, what is your question? How do I get the cards to pull up? What the fuck are you talking about, first of all? And aren't, aren't I shipping it to the people who bought that team? Of course I am. Uh, so that begs the question, what the fuck are you talking about? Amar Darbo, Seahawks, that's what I'm talking about. Number 2149. Nothing there. Why am I selling cards? Uh, ooh, a red Carson Wentz for the Eagles. Very nice. That's number to 49. That's a sweet card right there. Uh, why am I selling cards? Because I feel like it, Lucas. I mean, no, listen. We are a, you know, box and case uh, breaking operation. But we also have, you know, the guy that pretty much gets all product for us. He's super big into the hobby. He collects all kinds of cards. So, you know, sometimes he buys products and he'll just have us rip it just for him. Uh, so, you know, the cards you see for sale are either his or, you know, cards that people did not pay for. Julius Thomas of the Dolphins, number 199, for example... You know, if we do a break and we break it and somebody's like, oh, I want a refund, you know, then we got to do the refund and then, you know, we're kind of stuck with those cards. So what do we do with the cards? We sell them. Mike Wallace of the Ravens, orange, that's the 275. I think not, not. Yeah, I think you. I think you understand. I, I pretty much explained myself. Odell Beckham to two seventy five for the Giants. So there are two men out. It looks like who Springer's on second base right now. Who's up to bat? I mean, listen. 
that's either the collection from the Gelf man, or like I said, you know, people just backed out. The Brian Arakbo of the Titans green is number to 99. But, you know, I want to say 90% of those cards are Gelfs that he just ripped a bunch of boxes, a bunch of cases, I should say, and was like, all right, put these on eBay. Corey Clement of the Eagles with an autograph. That guy breaks stuff for shits and giggles. Eagles getting a hit there. Nothing else there. Juju Smith Schuster of the Steelers. Green. That's number 299. How about Martavis Bryant out there trying to get more playing time? And he threw the rookie under the bus. He's like, I'm way better than the rookie. Why should he get more snaps than me? Well, maybe because, uh, you know, you stay getting suspended, bro. Jared Cook of the Raiders. Number 2, 199. I did tell you the number, Katie. Well, I didn't tell you the number because it doesn't exist. Come on, Katie. Come on, Katie. You know I take care of you. If there was a number, I would have told you. There is no number on there, ma'am. You, you got to have a little faith in your boy. got to have a little faith in the cardboard, Moses. All right, let's put these stuff away. Oh, yeah, I heard. I heard he's going to be inactive this week uh, because of his social media ranting. Oh, I'm going for Penn State all day. Fuck Ohio State forever. Fuck Ohio State forever and ever and ever. I will never forget the Tostinos Bowl. Ever. Oh, there you go, Katie. You know, Uncle, Uncle Jesse, you know, you keep your faith in me. I'm going to do something nice for you. If I was, dude, if I was Coach Tomlin, I would have cut. I would have been cut Martavis. I heard Josh Gordon is also trying to come back into the league. Dow the Seahawks. That's the 149. What else we got? Ooh. For the Chiefs, Len Dawson with some gold action on there. What's that number two? Number 10 out of 10. That is sweet.
to 199 to Ralph Suggs of the Ravens. Responding to those messages here. TJ Watt Fire coming your way. Well, hopefully you bought, you know, the Steelers. Which you pretty much always do. To 149, Elijah Qualls of the Eagles. Autograph right there. Hope you cut the, uh, the numbering, Katie. Did I die? No, but I kind of feel like it as far as like, you know, barely being able to breathe right now. Quincy and Numa are the Jets. Cracked ice, number to 99. 75, I'm sorry. I did open NT Baseball. There was a pretty sick cut signature for the... Uh, who was it for? For the I think it was for the Reds or for the for no, it was for the Cardinals. And there was a oh, there was also an Aaron Judge to forty nine. You know, no big deal. Number to two seventy five, Robert Woods of the Rams. To seventy five, Carlos Henderson. Cracked Ice Auto. Very nice. Yeah, uh, what you call it? CBJ sent me a text message, so I had to respond to the Jesus. You know, when the, when the Jesus hits you up, you got to respond. Nothing there. Hey, what's up, Tim? Thank you for joining the uh, the chat finally, my man. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Uncle Jesse don't bite. Unless you want me to. Kevin White to 199 for the Bears. For the Panthers to 149, Kelvin Benjamin. By the way, Devin, the NT we did was for eBay. The uh, the store break still hasn't gone. I do have it on the website. Uh, and I'm down to break it tonight. If we can get it filled, we'll get that thing done. Uh, trust me, I, understand, I, I, I know exactly where you're coming from, Tim. You know, Taewon Taylor, the Titans there to 149. Dude, I'm in this office minimum 12 hours a day. Five days a week. Joe Williams of the Niners with the cracked ice auto. That is nice. Bellinger almost hit that thing out the park. Well, listen, I'll say this much, Tim. That's uh, the Joe Williams to 75. I'll say this much. As a, you know, you're a Bills fan. I'm a Dolphin fan. We do have that mutual respect for each other. Uh, I think we can pretty much say fuck the Jets and fuck the Patriots, though. Delaney Walker, the Titans, orange to 275. I will say, though, the Bills are looking pretty good this year. Looking pretty good. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what you guys are doing out there in Buffalo. You know, setting, setting yourselves on fire in the pregame <laughs> during the... Uh, during the what you call it, 
during the tailgate. Gary on Conley of the Raiders. Orange stuff right there. 275. Dylan G, I would have played the lottery right after. Because that's some nice luck to have right there. Alright, so that's four boxes down, eight to go. You think the Patriots are winning the division? Well, Rick, I don't think I like you anymore. Listen, wings laced with booze are always a good time. Always a good time. Ugh, gotta open up all these boxes here. All right. What happened with Altuve? Or you mean the Altuve I have back there? Or did he do something good? I don't know. I'm going to delay over here. Altuve auto is going up. I might just have to post that Altuve up then. I got Altuve up the bat where I'm at right now. First pitch, thought he was going to bunt. Okay. I got to pay off that college loan, man. It's no joke, dude. Paying $500 every week is no bueno. Trevor bought two spots in the NBA hoops tonight for eBay or on the website, Trevor? On eBay, gotcha. Well, good luck, man. That break will happen at midnight. Altuve, what? Altuve with the solo shot. Damn. Yo, Astros, what a fucking game. Holy shit. I apologize, guys. Actually, no, I don't apologize. What a fucking game. Dude. There you go, Altuve. Yo, Dodger fans got to be sick as fuck right now. Boy, they're looking crazy right now. Oh, my God. Dude, that's awesome. I want the Astros to win. I really do. For the city of Houston. And, you know, it's always nice to see people win their first championship. Yeah, Tim Roach. It's, it's been... It's been pretty rough. And, you know, Prism is no joke either. There's a bunch of cards in Prism as well. Corey Coleman of the Browns Orange. That's the 275. And a Correa's up to bat right now. If Correa hit a home run too, that'd be fucking ridiculous. Sam Bradford Vikings to 149. Don't spoil it for me. No way. No way. No fucking way! Are you serious? Back-to-back -back homers? Oh, my God. Holy shit. Yo, get that man out of the mound. Oh, my God. Astro fans, you got to be loving this shit right now. Dodger fans, I'm sorry, bro. But, dude, you got to pay respects where it's due. This is ridiculous. Back-to-back -back homers? What? Uh, Cam Newton of the Panthers, though, to 199. Yeah, I might get carpal tunnel. I'm probably not going to masturbate tonight. 
My hands are uh, already starting to feel it. Greg Olson, orange for the Panthers. First time ever in the World Series back-to-back -back homers. Dude, I believe it, man. Are they going to make it three for three? Back to back to back? Guriel is at bat right now. Well, obviously, you guys know I'm on a delay. De Hold the fuck up. This is kind of nuts. Jared Goff in the ramp for the Rams. It's a red parallel. The red parallel is numbered to 49. Some dude tried to, like, crash the Astros' bullpen. What happened there? The reason I say it's nuts, the one and two quarterbacks red parallels in this case. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Let's continue. So what happened there with that fan? I, I'm seeing they, they were like escorting some guy out with, you know, kind of with his hands behind his back. I'm assuming with handcuffs. Sterling Shepard of the Giants to 199. What a game, dude. Back-to-back -back homers, bro. I think I'm starting to fall in love with baseball, dude. That's fucking crazy, man. Charles Harris cracked ice to 99 for the Dolphins. And the base hit now for, for Guri. There you go. There you go, Yuri. Or Yuli, my bad. Astros on fuego right now. Astros on fuego. <laughs> Wentz, Dak, or Goff? Is that a serious question? I'm going Wentz all day, bro. Carson Wentz, honestly, is doing things at quarterback this early in his career that I don't think we have ever seen before. Like, I don't think people really appreciate how good Carson Wentz is this early in his career. It's kind of ridiculous. Deshaun Watson, orange for the Texans. That's the 275. Yo, the manager for the Dodgers, you should have been got rid of that baseball, the the uh, the pitcher there, Fields. Should have been got rid of him after the first home run. To 149, Jeremy McNichols of the Bucks with the autograph. I'm just being, I'm just being honest, Dylan G. I mean, don't get me right, don't get me wrong. The greatest quarterback to ever breathe, you know, oxygen, is named Dan Marino. You know, lace is out. Uh, but, I mean, I got to give credit where credit is due, man. Carson Wentz is is playing out of, out of his mind, dude. Out of his mind. I'd be in love with Carson Wentz, too. Stacy Coley of the Vikings to 149. Dude, Dodgers bullpen is... is uh, I'm starting to, to notice... Solid. The reason I'm noticing is because, you know, now that I'm paying more attention to baseball and actually watching baseball games, you know, I'm reading articles and things like that. So we have 150 Panini points, as you saw there. That has to get randomed off at the end of the break. Uh, dude, always have faith in your team. Always have faith in the team. Then crazy things like that happen, man. Didi Westbrook for the Jaguars autograph. Dude, I always watch the World Series. Don't get me wrong. I always watch the World Series. But now that uh, pretty much my job is to pay attention to who's hot and who's not. And, you know, I do watch baseball. I'm, I'm sorry. I do watch basketball. And I do watch football. So that's, you know, pretty easy for me. For me to be like, oh, this guy's the baller. This guy's not. Well, Gerald... It's technically supposed to go at 12 midnight, the, uh, the the hoops break. But as you can see, I'm doing a break right now. So when I'm done with this break, I will do the hoops break. By the way, Gerald, that NBA hoops break is going to take me a long-ass time to do. It'll probably take me an hour and a half, maybe two hours to go through it. So uh, I hope you got your popcorn ready, Gerald. Or anybody else out there watching... Uh, that wants to see the NBA hoops. It's supposed to go at midnight. But uh, as you guys can see, there is there's a whole bunch of cards in Prism Football. So, as soon as I'm done with this break, I will do the next eBay break of NBA hoops. 
which like I said, will be taking a long time. You're actually eating popcorn? Well, listen, they don't call me the Cardboard Moses for nothing, bro. Not only do I lead people to the promised land, but uh, I also have a little bit of a, of a third eye, if you will. I see, I see things, and I know things. Yeah, I'll probably be breaking until 2 in the morning. I mean, 5 in the morning, Eastern time. Oh, I was tripping for a second. I'm like, hold up. The the Astros got another at bat? And then, you know, and then I realized it was a call to the bullpen. I don't mind breaking until 5 in the morning. As long as we're filling breaks, you know? I really don't mind breaking all day. I've been breaking all day nonstop so far today. And I really don't mind doing it. No, I'm keeping I'm keeping the lotto numbers to myself. I mean, listen, truth be told, I don't play the lottery just so that I can hold on to the luck for you guys. I'm doing y'all a favor. Rodney Adams Vikings, that's the 275. Cuz if I did play the lottery, then I'm keeping all the luck to myself. So when I hit big, guess what? You ain't going to see me no more. Is that what you want? Do you want no more cardboard Moses in your life? Julio Jones of the Falcons with the camouflage parallel. I think that's the 25. Yep, 10 to 25. Doug Baldwin of the Seahawks to 275. Boy, Dodgers looking crazy. Dodgers look like they lost already. And I don't blame them. I would be pretty bummed out if they just blasted me for three runs in the final fucking inning. Quincy Wilson of the Colts. Autograph. I think it was two runs in the final inning. I'm probably... Actually, no. It was 3-2 in the ninth, wasn't it? Whatever. All I know is back-to-back -back home runs is ridiculous. Speaking of ridiculous, if you're the Rams, you're pretty happy. That's a sweet card right there. Josh Reynolds. With the autograph for the Rams. That is number to 49. Dodgers getting out of the inning. Down 5-3. to three. Okay, so seeing as how your boy really doesn't know that much baseball, question time. Stupid question from Uncle Jesse time. Uh, since the Astros are up... And they're in extra innings. If the Dodgers don't score in the in this inning, the game is over, right? James Conner of the Steelers with an autograph. And the and the green on there too. That's number to ninety nine. That is nice. Good amount of color in this stuff. I'm liking Prism. I'm liking Prism football. And we're about halfway through it, actually. Chris Godwin of the Bucks. That's to what? 199? Yup. Ha, yup. Well, see, if you like nice things, there you go, Steel Curtain. Uncle Jesse comes through again. Alright, cool. So I'm glad that the very minimal knowledge I have of baseball comes through. Uh oh, a little hit quake. A little hit quake. Mike Wallace of the Chargers to 149. There's people out there that don't like nice things. You know, they're out there. Like I once met a girl who, you know, you know, you know standard bullshit questions when you meet people. Oh, hey. Well, you know, what kind of music do you like? She doesn't listen to music. And that's when I knew I should never talk to that person ever again. Luke Keekley of the Panthers, orange. That's too, uh, too... Like, who doesn't like... Like, who does not listen to music? Like, that's so... That's so weird. 
I asked her, I was like, oh, you know, what's your what's your favorite genre of music? She's like, I don't listen to music. I'm like, excuse me? Yeah, I don't listen to music. Um, okay. Andrew, look at the Colts. Two one ninety nine. Yeah, strange is an understatement. Eli Manning of the Giants with the uh, purple cracked ice to seventy five. Yes, sir, for the Giants right there. For the Rams, Robert Woods to 149. The cards are definitely nice, man. Parallels are sweet. Good amount of color in this product. Nice color autos, too. I'm digging it. I'm digging it, Prism. I'm digging it. I could do without all the, the base cards, you know, if I'm being honest. But they're still nice. James Harrison Steelers. Nah, dude, this was back in college. I had her for a class, and she, you know, I thought she was cute. Good-looking girl, you know? But that'll only get you so far in life. So that's why I chatted her up. And y'all know me. I'm pretty good at talking shit. I'm pretty good at just talking. So that's what I did. And I made her laugh, blah, blah, blah. She thought I was cute. I thought she was cute. So, you know, we're getting to know each other. And, you know, it turns out she doesn't listen to music. Like, at all. And then I find out she's like a super, super, super religious chick. And, you know, and that's that's their belief. They don't listen to music or celebrate holidays or anything like that. I'm like, okay, well, that's kind of... Okay. I respect it to each their own. Yasio Puig just hit a solo shot. Uh oh, hit quake. Uh oh, it's a hit quake. You know what that means. I might see some fire coming up here. Yasiel Puig trying to get the Dodger fans to stand up. It's a 5 4 game, no outs. At least where I'm at. Musgrove, get it together. You hate Skip Bayless? That was kind of random. You know, as we say in the streets, I fucks with Skip Bayless. I fucks with Skip Bayless. Oh, it's Giles? I thought it was Musgrove. I thought his number was 55, at least from the angle I saw. And I think Musgrove is 55. And he had his head down, so I was like, bruh. Lorenzo Alexander for the Bills. My Bills fan out there. There you go. I don't know if you got the Bills, but it's a nice card there. That's the 49. 99, I'm sorry. One out. Two more to go. And the Astros tie things up. Astros are undefeated in Houston, so watch out. Kenny Stills of the Dolphins. To 149. No, I'm sorry. 199. For the Colts, 149, Malik Hooker with the autograph. Come on, bruh. You got to throw six strikes. Get out of this game. 
Go back to Houston tied up, dog. All right, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? A whole bunch of colors you guys can see. Tyreek Hill of the Chiefs, orange. That's nice. I'm going to speed things up a little bit because we're approaching midnight. NBA Hoops is supposed to go at midnight. Marcus May, Jets with the teal action there. Nothing there. Put this away. In orange, Emmanuel Sanders, Broncos. For the Giants, Evan Ingram with the autograph. That's nice. It's mighty quiet in the chat right now. What y'all up to? What is this? The illumination insert for Aaron Rodgers. Of the Packers. That's a nice looking card. I don't know if it's numbered. It is not numbered. First time seeing of that. That's a cool looking card. Marcus made Jets to 149. Caught him swinging. Nothing there. Chris Carson of the Seahawks, orange. Come on. What is it? Two down, one to go. Le'Veon Bell for the Steelers to 149. this half got a green Lamar Miller for the Texans went to middle school with the guy now he's in the pros hashtag that's what's up what else we got for the Giants Wayne Gallman two giant rookies coming up there A strike number two player. One more. And the series is tied. Alright, so that's it for that box. Got five left. Matt Bonner. That sounds familiar. Was he like a center? Seven footer or something? Oh, dude, really? Full count? Come on, bro. this oh man they got a man on first oh I know who you're talking about now Rick yes I know he's on Matt Bonner
Alright, let's see what I got in this. We got an orange Jehu chess on for the Chiefs. Now, for those of you waiting to see the NBA hoops break, I will do it as soon as I'm done with this prison football, guys. All right. Josh Doxson of the Redskins, orange. Did you really go to school with Tom Brady? A cracked ice for Kyle Rudolph of the Vikings. It's a cool card. Purple stuff right there. Rick, that's actually pretty cool, man. Is that a super? It's a super! Oh, snap. Super Fractor Action. What is that? Like Got like a little smudge on there. Or is that part of the actual pit? I don't know if it's part of the pit. I think it's part of the picture. Willie Sneed of the Saints with the Super Fractor. That's, oh, well, it's number two out of five, not a Super Fractor. This is number two out of five. So what do we? What would you call this thing? A wild pitch, hit the ground, man took second base. Got a man in scoring position now. Bobby Wagner of the Seahawks. With the teal. Dodgers tied it up. Well, thank you for spoiling that for me. No spoilers, guys. No spoilers. Kevin King of the Packers with the purple cracked ice. To 75. Autograph. Nothing there. Devontae Parker of the Dolphins Orange. For the Bengals, John Ross the third with the autograph. Understandable freaking nature. I'm still pulling for the Astros though. Base hit. And he's safe at home. Tie game. I just saw it. Damn. What a game. What a game. Jordan Leggett of the Jets. With the autograph. What a game. Tied up. Dude, get Giles out of there. Clearly he don't got it. Get him out of there. Get him out of I would have been got him out of there. Uh, am I going to do a 20 caser of NBA hoops? Fuck no. Unless, it go, unless we can sell it for enough money, then fuck yeah. Vic Beasley Jr. to 149 for the Falcons. You know, I still haven't even seen the numbers for this. I'm curious to see how this how this is done. Jabril Peppers of the Browns with the green stuff. Tory Smith of the Eagles with the teal. That's to 149. I'm sorry, 199. Chicka chicka wow wow. That dude was hauling ass to get home. For the Eagles, well, thought it was going to be an auto. Every time they're upside down or backwards, I just assume they're autographs. Ronnie Adams of the Vikings, teal. A 
that's it for that. All right, I got four boxes left. Got four boxes left. Running out of 400 count boxes to put all this stuff in. Whew. You know what makes this even better? Is after I'm done with this, then I got to do 20 boxes of NBA hoops. Awesome. Which, by the way, uh, I will not be sleeving anything that is not either a 101 or an auto. You know, everything else, it will get sleeved. Numbered cards will get sleeved. Uh, just not while I'm breaking. Otherwise, it's going to take me another two and a half hours to do. Which is going to which is gonna push back all the other breaks another hour or two. And uh, I'm just not going to do that. Yo, when is this inning going to be over? Astros had the game. They were one out away. Oh, wow. It's a good thing it hit the umpire, too. Ha, 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 ha. Is that what you're talking about, Sports Cards Freak? Yo, shout outs to that umpire for taking it, yo. Because if he did not get hit by that ball, that dude probably could have scored. That guy probably could have scored. Oh, wow. What a, re what a crazy game, dude. Let's keep it going. Keenan Allen, Teal for the Chargers. Homeboy almost got hit by a pitch. Astro pitchers, what are y'all doing? I'll tell you right now, if the Astros win, they got to take that umpire out to launch or something. Curtis Samuel with the RPA. There it is. Panthers get the RPA. I think it's one per case. There it is. Let's keep it going. Purple Cracked Ice, Trent Taylor, Niners. They put in Cameron Maven? Uh, do I think the second prison break will be before 2 a.m.? Well, I never start breaks before they're supposed to be done. So, if it's scheduled for 2 o'clock, it's going to go at either 2 o'clock or after. Uh, but never earlier. Or Dory Jackson of the Titans with the auto. So, the inning is over. Alright, another done question. Uh, Lurk Josh, lucky. I want to watch some porn. Alright, so now, another dumb question from Uncle Jesse. Alright, so the game is tied 5-5. Five, five. If the Astros score... That's a walk-off, right? They win. Like, that's it. The Dodgers don't get another at-bat. Jeremy Macklin with the purple cracked ice for the Ravens. Uh, I don't think the sun will come up. Oh, I'm doing the next NBA hoops tonight for sure. I mean, if it's scheduled for tonight, I'm going to do it tonight. Damon Get Harrison of the Giants to 149. As soon as I'm done with this break, I will do the next NBA hoops for eBay. Do not worry. I will be doing that. Trust me. Josh McCown, orange for the Jets.
Yeah, I'm gonna. I mean, I'm not gonna fly through it, but I am gonna go through it pretty quickly. Like, I'm not gonna sleeve everything. I'm only gonna sleeve and top load the autographs. Any cards that are like numbered, unless it's numbered like stupid low to like five or ten or something like that, I'm not even gonna sleeve it. I'll put it to the side and we'll sleeve it, uh, you know, when the sorters get to sorting it. They do that anyway. Uh, I've just become accustomed to sleeving anything that needs to be sleeved while I open the the, the cards or whatever. Uh, but considering how long it takes to do the break, I'm just not going to do it. Yeah, CBJ doesn't sleeve, exactly. Julio Jones, orange for the Falcons. I do because, you know... I uh, I usually sort my breaks at the end of the night. So when when you see me go off air at like three four in the morning, you guys are probably thinking, "Oh, poor Jesse, he's gonna go home now." Whatever, whatever. No, no, I'm still in the office till like six, seven, eight in the morning, sorting, trying to get things out to you as quickly as possible. So uh, yeah, I'll tell you right now, I am not looking forward to sorting these breaks. That is uh, not going to be fun. But that is the struggle. And the joys of being your own boss, baby. Isaiah Ford for the Dolphins to 75. Well, that's a shame, Lurk. And then again, I don't blame you because I barely watch baseball, so I kind of feel the same way. I love football, so I know all these dudes. Well, for the most part. That's it for that. So, question. Like I said, if the Astros score here at the top of the 11th, is it game over? Three boxes left. It's not. The Dodgers got to go at bat then. Maven just got in the game and he gets a base hit. There you go. Get hype, my man. The game can go on forever. I feel like you're trolling me. So even if the Dodgers score right now, the Dodgers still need to, to, to go at bat. But if the Dodgers scored and went, a, went ahead, then the Astros wouldn't have an at bat, correct? The longest game went for 33 innings? Jesus. Home team always gets a chance to tie it up. See, learning learning nice stuff, man. Uh, is the pay nice, Lurk Josh? Uh, I don't want to answer that because I'll just depress myself. Uh, right now, dude, I'm just I'm paying my dues, man. I'm paying my dues. Putting in time. Putting a little extra elbow grease. And hopefully one day it will pay dividends. But it's not right now, if I'm being honest. Who has the Steelers? Marshawn Lattimore of the Saints. That's an auto for the Saints.
Uh, yeah, Bowman Tech went already, Mandy. I will upload it when I get a chance. Uh, it's just the breaks that I'm doing today are pretty nuts. The Prism football has taken me about an hour. Probably going to take me an hour and a half to do. The NBA Hoops has taken me, took me two and a half hours to do that. So, Bowman Tech did break. I just haven't uploaded it yet. The one for eBay. I've done straight eBay today, Mandy. TJ Watt of the Steelers right there. That's a nice one. I ran out of top loaders. I need to grab some more. I'll be right back. I'm trying to watch the game, but it's kind of hard to do two, three things at once. It is Lurk Josh. I'm not even going to lie. A homer? Did he just homer? Holy shit. Astros on fire right now. Dude, what a ridiculous game. What a ridiculous game. Oh, well, Mandy, as far as the store break is concerned, uh, CBJ took that down. One, we don't have the case. We only received one case of it. Uh, we're having issues right now with the distributor. As soon as we get that case, we will uh, put it back up on the website. And another reason why it's off the website is because CBJ is adjusting prices for the teams. Uh, but you do keep your team. You know, for whatever team or teams you bought, uh, Mandy, they're yours. You know. It's just the uh, CBJ took it down because we do need to adjust prices uh, on that. Yeah, I apologize for that, Mandy. I, I apologize for any inconvenience. Tim Williams of the Ravens with the auto. Have I ever farted during the break? All the fucking time. All the time. You guys just don't you don't, you don't hear it. You don't hear it. Eli Manning of the Giants teal. That was a two run shot too. Of course I'm taller than Altuve. Anybody's taller than Altuve. Altuve's like what? 5'4", five, 5'5". Five, five? I'm 5'10", baby. Golden Tate of the Lions to 25. Jamal Charles Broncos, Teal. Nothing there. As soon as I'm done with this break, I will be doing the eBay NBA hoops, guys. The Mike Evans right there, red for the Bucks. That is number to forty-nine. That's a cool looking card, especially with the Bucks colors. It looks just looks nice. If Bregman homered, that would be cool. <clears throat> Instead, he pops up for the Jags. Alan Hearns. <coughs> Drink some water here. All righty, let's continue. For the Titans, Delaney Walker. To 149. Uh, probably not, Sports Card Freak. 
Elijah Hood are the Raiders red. That's nice. If you order Cheetos and a Coke, then maybe. Good luck. I got two boxes left. Let me put this stuff away here. Putting up the way these base cards. What a day, what a day. As I've said, for those of you guys waiting to see NBA hoops, I will do it as soon as this is over, guys. You could never eat too many peanut M&Ms. There's no such thing. You ate like three pounds, maybe you just got diabetes, like a, a little minor version of diabetes, maybe. I've never tried the almond ones, actually. M&Ms are my favorite, uh, uh, what do you call it, like candy, I guess. Well, sports cars freak, that's why you want to throw up. You got, you got way too much stuff going on there. So inning over, Astros up 7-5. Any chance they could put Verlander up there again? All right, let's go through this box. We're almost done. You know, I've never had a Mr. Good bar. Does that make me a bad person? Tredavious White, orange for the Bills. So now I know what to buy when I get up out of here at like 10 in the morning. Richard Matthews of the Titans, purple cracked ice. Ty Montgomery of the Packers to 149. Odell Beckham with the illumination insert. It's a cool card. Nathan Peterman of the Bills, Teal. Well, listen, all the good shit is simple shit. Panini points that we got a random, 250 of them. So that's a total of 400 Panini points that need to be randomed. Because I have one for 250 and another for 150. I think that adds up to 400. Random that at the end of the break. Matt Ryan Green for the Falcons. I think for these next Prism and Hoops break, well, for the Hoops, I'm for sure not going to sleeve anything that's not an autograph because that's just, you know, ridiculous how many cards are in that. 
And I think I'm not going to do the same thing for this prism either. I'll put them to the side and I'll sleeve them uh, when I'm sorting them. But as far as doing it while I break it, it's taking up way too much time. And it's, it's really affecting the, the, the scheduled breaks. So it, when it gets to that point, it is a problem. And it's not like I can go any faster. There's just way too many cards. Jonu Smith of the Titans with the autograph. Cinnamon Bun Oreo Cookies? What? Those are like two different snacks. I think the best candy in the world is peanut M&M's. But Skittles and Starburst are like tied right behind them. Numbered 1 of 49, CJ Beathard for the Niners. That's a good card. That is a good card. And it's red too, so you know it's nice. Looks good with the Niner colors too. Very nice card. It's been a somewhat solid case. Jamal Adams for the Jets. <laughs> like, I really don't care. Gotta die from something, right? Might as well die doing something I enjoy. Whoa, yo. Dan, I want what you and Katie have, man. I'm jealous. Sorry to hear that, Rick. Uh, I recently had an uncle who we had to amputate one of his legs. Not we, but you know. I say we because, you know, we're a family. We're all in, in it together. And di diabetes runs in, in my family as well. Uh, he had to amputate one of his legs recently. Which uh, pretty bum bummed me out a lot. I'll check it out when I get a chance, uh, Jason. All right, last box mojo. Good luck, guys. Yeah, I'm sorry to hear that, Rick. Woo! The first and last box had the hotness. A green Kareem Hunt for the Chiefs. Very nice. Oh, well, listen. You got a man that can cook for you. You know, I'm just I'm just going to stop talking. Because then, now, now, now I'm just jealous. So I'm just going to shut up and uh, continue hating my life. Josh Malone, orange for the Bengals. What else we got here? The illumination insert for Cowboys, Dak Prescott. These cards just look cool, man. A green Kevin King of the Packers.
for the Dolphins, Charles Harris with the autograph. Well, Dan, Katie, do either of you guys have siblings? I mean, I'm, I'm single. I don't have no kids. My credit is fucked because of my student loans. I'll be honest there. Um, I think I'm kind of good looking. I, I'm funny looking. So I'm kind of funny. So if you guys have any siblings that are single, hey, put me down. Well, listen, I appreciate your love, Katie and Dan, but what about you? I know y'all I know y'all got some siblings that are single. Holla at your boy. You know, that way we can keep the hits in the family, you know what I'm saying? Plus, y'all like good green. I like good green. Dan is a chef. I like to think I'm a chef. Like, it's meant to be. It's I'm good with my hands. Actually... That's not the first time I've heard that. Actually, I, I didn't want to take it to that level because you know I don't want to be full on nasty. Well, technically it is hashtag Rip City Cards after dark, so I guess I could be nasty. You know they've called you know used to call me Magic Fingers, still do. Josh Malone for the Bengals. Did that man just Homer? Dodgers seven six right now. Oh well, I don't I don't have a medicinal card, but I do know people that know people that know people. I like I like how this room is just straight potheads. I do enjoy that. Gerald McCoy for the Bucks to one forty nine. Gerald, I'm, I I'm, I just kind of just saw. A paragraph there, but I haven't read it. I might, I might do a quick Google search on that. Robert Woods of the Rams, orange. Oh, you mean like my student loans? No, I'm fucked on my student loans, bro. My student loans are private student loans. I also have some uh, loans through the government, Stafford loans, blah blah blah. I'm fucked. I am fucked. Jehu Chase on of the Chiefs. Honestly, my only saving grace is uh, this business right here. If I can uh, get this thing built up and, you know, get a nice following where I have hundreds of people in the room and we're constantly buying breaks and filling them and getting them done, both on eBay and on the website, I'll be making some decent money and I can pay my loan off, you know, fairly quickly. So, uh, yeah, I just tried to guilt trip you guys into helping me fill some more breaks. And I'm done now. Well, Katie, that sounds good. But, uh, yeah, private is what's private loans are what are kicking my ass right now, Gerald. If I was a girl, I wouldn't have any loans because I would just be a prostitute. And, you know, I'd be selling my, my, my thing. For pennies on the dollar. Dude, if I was a girl, I'd be the biggest whore. And it's not even... I'm not even joking about it. I really would be the biggest whore. Like, anytime one of my friends that are girls... I do have platonic friends that are girls. Crazy as that may seem. Um, But anytime they complain about money, I just look at them. And I'm like, bro, you have the money maker right there. Katie, I don't, I don't think I'm ugly. I think I'm ugly enough to be cute. You know what I mean? Like, you ever see like a dog, or a, or a pet, or anything that's just like really fucking ugly, but it's so ugly that it's adorable. That's, that's me. All right, got a random put in your points. Going seven times later, Katie. Thanks for hanging out. So we're going seven times. We're going to random uh, these 400 Panini points. I need to grab the teams first. 
<laughs> Alright, let me chicka chicka wow. Well, you know what they say, uh, Jason. Cardboard Moses brings the uh, the girls. I don't know, man. All right, so what did I? I just did football, so I need the football team, so I can do this random uh, for the Panini points. It is going to be among all 32 NFL teams. Just got to pull the random up, which I am doing now. Paste it. Boom. There's the list with the teams. Top team in the list gets put any points, and we are going seven times. Good luck, guys. And the money shots. Here we go. It's going to the Colts. Colts will be receiving 400 Panini points. Congrats, Colts. Going to the Colts. All right, let's take this down. The moment you have all been waiting for, the recap time. All right, here we go, guys. Malone, Bengals. Harris, Dolphins. Hunt Chiefs, that's huge. Beathard Niners. Smith Titans. Williams Ravens. Watt Steelers, that's also huge. Lattimore Saints. Ford Dolphins. Jackson Titans. Samuel Panthers RPA. Leggett Jets. John Ross Bengals. King Packers. Gallman Giants. Ingram Giants. Hooker Colts. Connor Steelers. Reynolds Rams, that's a good card. Wilson Colts, Westbrook Jags, McNichols Bucks, Williams Niners, Henderson Broncos, Qualls Eagles, Clements Eagles, that's a good card. Williams Chargers, Cunningham Texans, a Redemption Blue Wave for Corey Davis and the Titans, Humphrey Ravens, Solomon Thomas Niners, Ford Dolphins, Jackson Titans, and the Cracked Ice. You know it and you love it. It's Deshaun Watson. Very nice. And that, my friends, was the break. I mean, look at these two big name rookies right here. Not bad. And that, my friends, as I said, was 2017 Panism Football 